episode two of Maz TV. And we've got a few segments for you guys today, some old, some new. And the first segment is Maz Up. Which is everything to do with Mazuma. New events, new services, new products, whatever it is that's going on with Mazuma. And after that, we have Tech to Date. Where we keep you up to date with what's going on with technology. And after that, we have What's in the Box. Where we open up some cool tech gadgets within the box and find out what's inside. And a segment that has temporarily been replaced by In My Shoes, and it's called Now Showing. Now, why are we featuring Now Showing right now? Because there's a lot of big events going on with film and television that mm -hmm. I just want to talk about. And another one that we have added is Add to Cart. Sometimes you look at something, it's cheap, but is it worth buying? Well, we, we're here to waste our money yes. to find out if it's worth buying. We will test it out for you guys. And then we have funny finds, just funny videos to brighten your day. Last, but definitely not the least, is buy or burn. This is when we run down all of the products that we mentioned throughout the show and talk about whether we would buy them or burn them. Mm -hmm. Now let's move on to the first segment. Mazza. We've got an ongoing sale on our Mazuma mobile store called Mazuma Spring Sale. Where you can get up to 75 pounds off our mobile phone. And now on to tech to date. So for the first topic, we have the cancellation of the Google Pixel 2 and 2XL. They are continuing with the 3 and the 3XL. Mm -hmm. So that means they're still going to keep producing the phones. And so either they're clearing inventory because they're canceling the phone, Right. Series highly unlikely, okay. or because they're getting ready for the 4 and the 4X. A newer phone, right? Yeah. And the other thing I love about it is it's running stock Android. So it's, okay. Yeah. So so it's like Google software from Google directly, no yeah. modifications. So that's one thing you can really rely on. That. Yeah. So if you're like an Android user, this is great for you. Exactly. And for our next topic, we have. I know it's a little past April Fools, but I just wanted to highlight what I thought was one of my favorite mm -hmm. April Fools pranks here. This okay? is actually pretty funny. This was a company called Hyper, and mm -hmm. they do make products where it's um, you connect it to the one eight, the one lightning cable slot on your I device on your on your iPad. Right, mostly um, Apple products, right? Yes, yes, most, mostly. Because yeah, because a lot of the times they don't have enough. They don't even have like an HDMI Exactly, slot, so their you know. job, their their actual job is to create those products. Mm -hmm. Now they've decided to, why not give you a, an availability for every port? So it came with uh, a 27,000 milliamp hour battery, two-in-one speaker and space heater, a total of 40 ports, nine USB- 40 ports? Yeah, 90 USB-C, nine, or excuse me, nine, Nine USB A, two micro SD, two SD, one 3.5 millimeter head jack, one HDMI, two display, one HDMI, 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 but I feel like if they just toned it back and they made it a real product, yeah, someone people, would buy it. That's someone. what I wanted to know. I was going to be like, did they put this on their website? Did people actually try to order this thing? I wouldn't be surprised if they left some comments. Yeah. Because that is an issue that Apple uh, I mean, look, look at that photo. It's like, it's like yeah. Oh yeah, it's beautiful. I love it. That's crazy. Even though I don't have an Apple product or Apple laptop, I, I would want it. <laughs> For our last topic in Tech to Date, you know, phone companies are really trying to make their phones stand out. Yeah. You know, pop up cameras, sliding screens for mm -hmm. keyboards, and all that stuff. Well, Oppo has decided to go in a different direction than we've seen before a pop up screen. I don't understand this problem. No one does. Well, why? 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 I mean, it's like, it's like, bing, or bing. Okay, I understand the foldable, foldable phone, you know, it turns into one big screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This isn't one big screen, this is just like an extra thing on it. I, I don't, it doesn't seem like a good use of space inside the phone, it's gonna be probably thicker. Oh yeah, it's probably gonna be a pretty heavy phone. Yeah, so, I mean, it's cool. Will there be a notch? Oh, I don't know. That's the least of the pop-up yeah. screens problem, a notch. I wonder but, if we'll actually see it. I they're, wanna, only, yeah. they're only images, we don't, even know if they're gonna go yeah, through. Yeah, well, Oppo, it's a mess. Mm. Next up, now showing. 
April 25th and 26th for the UK and US release dates for Avengers Endgame. Woohoo, that's exciting. Yeah. This is what everyone is excited for. This is what everyone's <sighs> been waiting for. A bunch of people have theories on it. Oh my god, YouTube is nothing but 30 minute theories for a f three know, minute video. <laughs> I'm like, I'm excited to finally find out what happens. Speaking of another ending of an era here, Game yeah. of Thrones, April 14, final season premiere. A lot of things are ending this 2019. Yes. A sad. <sighs> it's both heartbreaking and nothing but excitement. Yeah. I'm happy. And, and also uh, more series on Game of Thrones as well. Just as much, just like, as many. What's gonna happen at the end? I've seen Everyone, quite a few. What I would want is one thing, but another thing I secretly hope happen is everybody dies. Because that's what the show has been about. Everybody dying. Serial killer. Psycho. What? <laughs> I think that's a bit much. You want everyone to die on Game of Thrones? Oh, right, because you haven't watched it. Don't bring it up. <laughs> I'm Every trying. Don't bring it up on the show. Don't put that in. For our first what's in the box item, we have Mazuma Premium Pack with our iPhone X. X. If you guys want to find out more about what's inside our premium pack, you can click the link in the description. So let's talk about what we have, though. The mm -hmm. iPhone X. Now, what I love about the iPhone X is its camera. The dual camera. One of the best things about iPhones in general. Are their cameras. And yes. also, high definition screen. It's yes. so crisp. And it's responsive. And also, another great thing is they don't have the fingerprint anymore. They have... Oh, Face ID. Yeah, it's not It's not new technology. It's just a design choice they went with. I remember yeah. a few years ago, I had a laptop with not Face ID, but face recognition. Oh, so. okay. Another great thing is that it's glass here and it's glass here too. That's pretty cool. Looks the sick. glass back is because of wireless charging. And um, the iPhone X is actually available on our website. Go check it out if you're looking for an upgrade. I heard it's on sale. So yeah, that is the iPhone X. So far, I love it. I want it. It's an impressive phone. Mm -hmm. And here we have funny finds. Here's the first video. Adam! <laughs> but I'm like, James. He was so serious. He uh, was so serious. He wanted to do that vape he trick. He really wanted to do that vape <laughs> trick. Next up, we have another one, another YouTube video here. So that's the solution with not having a soprano in your group. Is that, is that the term? I just call it really high pitched. Yeah. Oh my god. They're like, we don't have a girl in our group, let's make someone suck on some helium. That's just clever thinking. Yeah, I thought it was funny until he brought out the big yellow balloon. That was perfect. Yeah, I guess so. And then now we have another video from Reddit. All right, what do we have here? We have. Oh, what is that? Snow, like deep yeah. snow. Like these that people are waist high. <gasps> and it does oh not care about the snow. Oh my god. Could you oh, imagine can you, that? Yeah, can you imagine how thick that snow is too? What a strong animal. I would be scared every second of that. <laughs> I would too. Oh no! Oh, this little brave guy. Oh my god. Why didn't anyone stop this? Oh, because the alligator's eating and the cat's trying to eat the food too. What the heck? You know what, cat? Cat, you don't realize you two are food. Debatable. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my god, look at this. The alligator's actually scared. He backed off. What? That's crazy. Oh my god. You know, if I was there and I saw that happen, I would tell the cat not to, you know. You would talk to the cat? Yeah, I would be like, oh, shh, 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 shh. <laughs> I don't want that to happen. Well, this cat got eaten. He seems fine. Yeah, well, I guess so. Poor alligator, though. He seemed pretty scratched up. <laughs> so, our topic earlier had to do with movies, Super right? Super excited. And this time for Add to Cart, 
We have products that can make you watch movies better or weirder, I guess. I would go with weirder. Okay. <laughs> so you just unscrew this from that and then slide that on. Let's see if it fits. It, yeah, oh, it pulls okay. out. There you go. Now we've got the iPhone on it and. You look amazing. Oh, look at this. If you're, you know, if you're on public transport and you, you just want to, you know, yeah, but you're not moving much, and look how much it's shaking, though. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's... Whoa, that uh, almost flipped over. Okay, uh, don't do that, guys. You don't want your phone to break. It's very sensitive to your body movements, so, you know, yeah, this... Is. Don't you just... I feel like it's fine if you're just, like, laying down in bed. In bed. Don't be in a car moving. It's not okay for public trip. Yeah. The thing is, though, like, it works. There's nothing wrong with it. Like, it's adjustable. You can really, like... You know, if you got a fat neck, you do that. Got a skinny neck, you do that. But it looks ridiculous. Oh, it looks ridiculous. Oh Please don't God. go out in public with this if you don't want to get bullied. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay, yeah, so that's another thing. It's definitely it's definitely a cheap product, that's what. Yes. You know what you pay for. Yes. Convenience. All right. We have here a mobile phone, video amplifier, and large screen magnifier. Your portable home cinema. Ooh, exciting. The images look good online. I don't know what it'll actually Hey, it doesn't look that bad. Let's be careful with that. It looks very fragile, actually. Oh, oh, this is the mirror. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is the magnifier. Look at that. Okay. So the phone? Hang on. Let's, let's... Uh, oh, it works. Does it? Hang on. It has to... You have to be like... Oh, you have to be like perfectly angled with it. You it can't... It works. Okay, try to view it, guys. There. Do you guys see that? I'm amazed that it works. It's not like, you know, it's easy to break, so you're gonna have to be careful with it. It's cheap cardboard. I gotta say, while it does its job, it's not the most pleasant viewing experience. Yeah, little... I feel like if you watch it a little too long, you will get a headache. It's a little warped. It's not like, obviously high def, and it's it's got the, the rings. It's not something that I think I would enjoy in any way. That's cute though. It serves a purpose. Yeah. And now we are on the segment of buy or burn. Our first product is... We have the Google Pixel. Buy or burn. Buy. Buy because it's cheap. Yeah. Never cheaper because it's <laughs> no longer available. Hyperhub. Um, probably... Oh, I don't know. Probably buy. I would sarcastically <laughs> buy that yeah, too. Yeah, it's like, it's why not? It's ridiculous, but also still practical. Yeah, because, and you know, I'll still use the USB port. Sure. Oppo pop-up screen phone. Burn, burn it, burn it to the ground. I don't want to see that thing. It just doesn't make sense. No. Burn. no. iPhone X. Oh, buy. Buy, because it's cheaper on Mazuma. <laughs> Avengers. Buy. Okay. Hell yes. I think I might buy a couple of and watch it again. Game of Thrones. Um, buy. Buy. Oh my god, buy. I can't wait. I wish I had a subscription to HBO. Yeah, me too, actually. <laughs> my friend does. Watch it as his place. <laughs> I'm gonna go watch it at her friend's place. <laughs> the the next, next phone holder. Um, uh, buy, because I'm lazy. Buy, but keep it at home and never use it in public. <laughs> and large screen magnifier. Um, buy, just because it's affordable and it's a good backup, I guess. Backup to what? Like if your laptop stops working or your iPad stops working. Uh, you need working. a little bigger, bigger screen. <laughs> I need sure. a bigger screen. You know, I think it's burned. I think there's better quality out there, but we'll see. And we're going to include here a surprise segment. We're going to call this one, What's on Your Mind? Because we read the YouTube comments, the Twitter comments, and all that good stuff. Yep. And we noticed for our first episode on Twitter, we had a comment specifically asking about the S10. Mm -hmm. Are there any issues with the fingerprint scanner? Okay, so um, we're just going to go to settings. And there you go. There One we time. go, done. Okay, it's finally added. See how well it works. Boom, quick. When, Boom. It, when it works, quick. it's quick. Yeah. No match. Mm. No match again. Come on. Oh, there, there we go. See, I just so, gotta tell the phone off a little bit and start so Yeah, so it works. Just yeah. it's it's disappointing that it's not so consistent in getting yeah. your fingerprint. Um, if that I guess that could be an issue for some people. It can get quite annoying. But yes, like I said, Apple has the same issue too. 
just that, but it only seems like it's more of an issue on the S on the yeah. Samsung one. So there you Hope go. Hope that answered your question. And mm -hmm. again, we look at our YouTube, Twitter, Facebook comments, and if you want to ask us something. Ask, go, ask away and hopefully we'll be able to answer your question. Yes, we will try to answer all of your questions on the next episode. And that was episode two. I hope you guys enjoyed all the rundown, all the news, all the announcements coming up as much as we did. If you guys liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow and like our social media pages and visit our website as well. Once again, I'm James. And I'm Carla. Thank you guys so much for watching. See ya.